Hello everyone and welcome back to some of Play Slay the Spire. We were totally getting demolished in Ironclad, even without Ascension Mode. I have no idea how I did that, but I did, I did do that. So, let's see if we are more lucky with the Silent. I won so many games with Ironclad and then I'm just screwing up. Transform two cards. We could take a, take a 100 gold and go for the early shop. I mean, lose 50% of your current HP seems terrible. So you just grant me, grant me your your gold. Thank you. We're going for the save route. This might take a while. That's an attack. Okay. Sadly. No more strikes. I wish I gotten the the one we got last episode with removing two cards from your deck. Would have been so great. Hit him good. Now he armors up again. It's pretty annoying. But we got another damage in. Now he's attacking again. Nice. Oh, is it time again for malaise? I think so. It's the wheel. Remove a card from deck. No, what is this? Seems like a relic. Gain a relic. Whoa, thread needle. What? That's so good. That's so very good. You cannot believe how that happened. Right now you apply poison, apply one additional poison. I would have loved to gain the calcifers. So 75. We can't get snake or skull and the other thing. We got, went for malaise instead of poison though. I think I want the card removal for sure. Now we could get prepared, could get an underhand strike, choke. Swift strike is zero cost, deal five damage. Do I want zero cost cards? So there is second shop on the way. There is. But we'll probably go this way for the other one. Hmm. Do we take a zero cost five attack? Zero cost deal five damage seems fine. But we just remove the strike. Let's take the piercing well. Oh, we could still take it. Swift strike. Really? Let's take it, see how it works out. If it's terrible, it's my fault. For just taking it. We'll go for the right route towards the elite. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Let me take some damage. I'm fine with that. The slaver. Taken. Oh, we got the plated armor. Oh ho ho! I was about to say taking two damage is not. I'm not proud of that, but look at that. That's seven damage. Got to protect the plated armor. Oh, plated armor is incredible. Look at this. Okay then, you can attack on 1 HP I guess. Nothing I can do against that. Swift Strike getting there. 
Slice is the same as Swift Strike. What does Swift Strike do when upgraded? 8 damage. Slice is worse when upgraded, I think. So, we'll go for the Elite fight. Even though it might be a bad idea. The only good thing we got right now in this run is the Thread and Needle. Just remove malaise. We got strike, swift strike, neutralize. So strike kills him and then two other attack kill him. Let's see. Strike kills him and then swift strike and neutralize to kill him. Gain some gold. Gain a dagger spray for AoE purposes. If in case we fight against the three ones, no, we fight against this guy. That's not a good fight. We're gonna we're gonna play the malaise. That's a good good start. Neutralize, prolongs the weekend, and then next turn we'll attack. We'll gain as much attack power as possible. He'll wake up anyways. We got the prep, all the prep work we could have get. Now it's a fight. I'll try to protect the plated armor. Actually, I could have just blocked twice, but I think this is fine. Protecting the plated armor still. Going for the big attacks. I didn't do the artifact on purpose. Since it, I think it only blocks the dexterity, and the dexterity is fine right now. Why is he attacking? Oh, because it's not weak anymore. Right, I was about to say, since he's only attacking for 11, if we gain 5 or 4 block, it doesn't matter, but it actually does matter. Since taken for so much. Okay, do we hit for 5 or do we gain 4 block? I think we hit for 5. Plated armor is preventing a bit of damage here. Now we go in, guns blazing. Wish I got some more attack power, but... Oh, maybe I should have used the artifact now. We'll lose some more HP. Not today though. That was nice. Got some damage in, blocked everything. And that's a lot of damage in coming here. Okay, I'd much rather block. Since he's on 5 HP, I mean, come on. There you go. Razor max HP by 10 is pretty nice. Crippling Poison? Nah. I have no idea what deck we're on. Could have been a great Poison deck with a Sneko. Do I Smith? 3 8 damage is nice. Weak for 2 turns is nice. Dagger Spray upgraded is incredible. Let's do that. And we'll gain this thing over here Blood Vial and some gold. Now the question is, do I upgrade again? I think so. Swift Strike is pretty good. I mean, it's gets plus three like a strike, but it costs nothing. I think Neutralize is the next best one. The weak two really does make a different difference. I 110 gold is not enough. We'd rather go for a few question marks.
15. Take in one hit to remove this. Now Dagger Spray kills him. I know our plated armor is taking one. Why are we taking two? Oh, 11. Oh, we've got 16 damage incoming. Okay. No need to block. Dagger Spray still kills him, so I didn't attack the Laos. Uh, maybe not, we're weakened. Yeah. Keep the damage to a minimum. With the with this way we'll block. Okay, that's an attack for ten. Sadly, plated armor took a hit, so we'll take in another hit. That's a big malaise. Got rid of the strength buff. I guess the strength buff right back. That's a hit for 10. Oh, he's weakened already. But I think it doesn't matter since he's dead. Terror is pretty good against elites, and since we're fighting against the elite next. could get cursed with normality, which is very annoying. We got curse. Whenever an attack card is added to your deck, upgrade it. That's actually nice. Dazes. Why couldn't we fight the other guy? We could make him vulnerable with the uh, one card and then just bash on him. On the other hand, we got the Dagger Spray. Oh, the melody is sad. Can't even play the Terror. Would have liked to. And plated armor is gonna take a hit. We as well, but plated armor is a bit more annoying. Let's see what we got here. We got this for sure. We got that for sure. And piercing well for sure. Get rid of your debuffs. You can block. Good malaise as well, but I think I'll malaise one of them later on. That's what I was afraid of. Honestly, that's bullshit. I mean, we got a lot of days, not gonna lie. But we got... We didn't even exhaust much in our starting deck. I mean, we got a curse, so 16 cards. And now we are 25, so 9 days is still left. We just got rid of 4. Okay, and then Malay's one of them. So he's neutralized, a bit at least. And then we hit the other sentry. He's attacking for 3 only, we can block that. Plated armor is blocking him right now for the next 3 turns whenever he attacks. And then later whenever he's weakened, we block him. Okay, that happens. We got Dagger Spray incoming next turn. Could put Vulnerable and Dagger Vulnerable on this guy and then Dagger Spray and then Strike. I think he's done so. And this one we can block. Very good start. That's dazed. That's a lot of dazes. There's still four more in my deck. 
No, six more in my deck, I think. Vicory Imagine no longer runs out of cards, relics and potions, and prices are reduced by 20%. Also footwork. Malaise him, swift strike this guy, we need to focus him. He is basically neuter. That's 10. Okay, we got that. This is, this is beautiful. We can dagger spray to kill it next turn. Or a strike, actually. Yeah, I'm vulnerable for a bit, but he's also strength minus. Now he gets neutral strength. So it's not too terrible. 6, 12, and 12. This is enough to kill him as well. I don't think we need any of this. 37 HP is a bit sketchy, even though I would like to upgrade, I think. Like, I'm, I'm okay with going into the boss fight at 50 HP or lower, but 37 was a bit too low. Even for my tastes. Piercing well next turn would have been great. But we didn't get there. No block him good, please. 6 damage. I think this is a pretty good... Oh, 6 times 2! Unfortunate. We're taking a lot of damage and our plated armor is gonna be gone. Did pay attention. That we probably could have gotten it better. Get rid of plated armor altogether? Yeah, okay. There we go, plated armor is gone. And of course, now we do draw the defense when we don't need them. And the strength up to plus two strength is also very annoying. But we got this. And a strike. Defend. Now with him being vulnerable, this might this is not this might speed up the clock, this is speeding up the clock a lot. Could have also defend just defended instead of survivor. It's only six damage. Now we would have needed Survivor. Or the weak potion. No, weak potion is not enough. But it's gonna be weakened next turn as well. Now he does his big attack. A uh, big attack is not so big, but I think all the burns get upgraded to burn plus. Since it's Inferno. And also he puts like three burn plus now deck. Oh no, that's... yeah, the burn gets upgraded to a burn plus. Neutralize again, and then defend. Normality makes the rest unplayable. Hitting us. We are going to lose a lot of HP now. So many burns. Another one. I don't think we need to get rid of Piercing Well Red quite already. Nice. Two attacks for nine. Six burns and a normality in there. 
need to get rid of the normality as fast as possible. I will piercing wheel now. Taking eight damage off the burns, one of this thing. Put another burn in there. This is getting very, very dangerous. Oh, neutralized, thank god. Oh, the burns! We're burning down to the ground! That's a big attack. We got it covered though. Good time to draw, not burns. Three more burns in our deck. Holy crap. Yep. Okay. Yes. Oh, the armor. No, why? An attack for 16? Dude! That's too, too big an attack. We got too many burns. We might be dying here. Neutralize him. Dagger spray him. Block. We're getting... We're on 1 HP. And he's on 1 HP. Oh! Draw a strike, please! Oh, a damage spell. Please, 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 please. Damage, 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 damage. Yes! Oh my god! Whoa! I'd love to get Grand Finale to work. You made me scared. I want to take Grand Finale. Transform all strikes and defense. Let's go. Okay, piercing whale. Two poison stabs. A second malaise. A skewer flying knee. Okay, so we got one block card. So that's a lot less block in our deck now. Makes me a bit scared. Only one shop we could go on, get to. Oh, there's the second one. So we can go through the here and go to two shops. Let's do that. Attack in for eight. I could also skewer him to hit him. For, oh, it's skewer plus. All oh, right, all the attacks we just got got up. Upgraded immediately. Poison step, skewer, flying me, and grand finale. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I mean that's we're blocking it, and the second melees will get into very little. Now we need more energy. Okay, got his plated armor a bit removed and we're still going strong. Okay, normality, get out of here. Get out. Two times two, yeah you can do that attack. Let's malaise you once more. I think it's fine. He's almost dead anyways. Pretty nice. I mean, Catalyst could be nice. We got two poison steps and a deadly poison in our deck. Prepared is better, I think. Especially since it can discard normalize. Discard it, deal 3 damage to a random enemy for each card discarded. Holy crap. We're going for the discard. It's 
So now we're pivoting into the discard deck. Yes, dagger spray, please. So this deals 5 and 10 damage. It's not quite enough. If we block... And flying knee... He gets downed and we got enough armor now with the plated armor to block all their damage. We need some more block, by the way. We even got the dexterity and then nothing. Pandora's box is strange. But always fun. You're dead and you're dead. I mean, he's not dead, but he's dead. Maybe I should have I should have attacked this one for sure. He strengthens up. Actually, disgusting. He's not dead yet. He's, he is dead in two turns. Sad bird. He's just gonna die to poison. 2 1, and now he's dead. Buffing up is not what you wanna do, believe me. Here we go. Uh, uh, ugh. So prepared is really good. Dagger throw is really good as well. But we got enough damage. And the unlanded strike is exceptional. And we got a mini unlanded strike basically. I can't get, say no to Dagger Spray. Surely. I wanted to poison him before, but I thought, no! Let's first draw cards, see what we get. We got a Dagger Spray. Taking 5 damage, yes. Not much we can do against that. And now you my dear Sphere Guardian, you're gonna get poisoned so hard. Now we'll prepare. Actually bad. We're taking ten damage and then he's dead in two turns, or maybe next turn. dead now. Yeah, I'm gonna embolaze you. Because I can. Another prepared. I'll just get them all. No, the tough bandages. No, why would you do that? You can't tease me like that. No! You're a monster. Let's smith. One of the prepareds, probably. We got four prepared now. We're so prepared for everything. 
Or we need some discard synergies. Look at this. We'll start with Terra. And we'll neutralize. We'll Swift Strike. Skewer and Poison Stab. That's 30 damage. And this is 9. And it's more than 30 damage. I could piercing well now. Because no, this way, right now I'm losing three I'm losing three life and one stack of plated armor. Oh the animation. And now we malaise you. And then we'll take the energy. Survivor this flying me. And then we'll draw another malaise with the flying knee energy and then he's just complete toast. Not quite though. Ooh. He's complete toast. How the hell? Oh my god, that was beautiful. Choke with all the prepareds. Yeah, I'll take it. That was absolutely astonishing. It's costing nothing is really nice. But I think prepared is better. Upgrade all the prepareds. Give me to Dreamcatcher and Frozen Egg whenever power is a card is added to your deck, it's upgraded. Okay. Then we'll go over here. That's a shop. With an Eviscerate, which I take for sure. And then that's that. Then we go over here and we'll upgrade the last prepared. And then we'll proceed. Go over here. What is this? Another shop? My dude. This is a block card. I want a block. This card all non attack cards could be nice though. Deals a lot of damage. But maybe we want the block. We got one card that blocks. We got those two piercing whales. We got a dexterity, we got a backflip. It's way too little block. Clock and dagger is the better one then. I guess we don't need much block with two malays and two piercing whales. Listen here. enough damage to kill this thing. That was pretty nice. Eviscerate with all the prepares is nice and the tincture. If only we had the bandage this would be a great great deck. Can't draw enough cards. Backflip. All prepared. Do we have another prepared? No, we got two here, red. Yeah. Hmm. It's 12 damage. It's not enough. But we can cloak and dagger. Do this. Shift him. Prepared. 
close. I don't think I want to malaise right now. We take in one armor and eight damage. It's not too nice. We eviscerate now together with two piercing whales. That's not what you want to see. Okay. That was quite a bit of damage. That went actually well. This does not though. Can we kill him? No, we can't. So that loses 3 strength and gets weakened. So he's weakened already. That's 11 and 12. It's just not enough damage, sadly. 11 and 12 is... 20... 3, 24, 25, we're close. So this does remove 6 damage, this block is better. And we'll take 9 damage again. So close. Get choked. Meet on the bone. If your HP is at or below 50%, heal up for 12. It's pretty nice. Well laid plans. Retaining a card is great. Now, this is bad. Now, this on the other hand is pretty good. Took the energized. Even though, oh, we could have retained cards. But no, I don't need to. Okay. Hit him, discard, end the turn. We'll retain the piercing whale. And the footwork, why not? It's no harm in that. Even though we would never want to play this one. Stabby McStab. Prepared for three is not what you want to see. On to reshuffle the prepared in now. I mean, that went well with the piercing whale and the malaise. We got him down to very little damage. Thank God we're not. Oh no! Wait, the Tinksha got got it got there anyway. Can we? I mean, Dagger throws nice and all. It's another loot, but is that is that good enough? Guess so. We'll rest now. <laughs> Am I gonna prepare some more? No. Infinite Blade Plus. I'll take it. I'll take it for sure. The Collector is so much harder now since they reworked it. So 
So what's the three things we'll play? Footwork, infinite blades, dagger throw, right? It's two cards gone out of the field. Got a bit of damage in there, but not very much. Nope, I should have choked first. It's 12. Oh, we could have killed one of them. What are you doing, my man? Actually, we can still kill one of them. So close. We got a prepared. No, that's too. That's not enough. We need mo one more card gone. Prepared. We draw five plus pre two from prepared. That's seven. We need eight for the grand finale to actually do what it needs to do. There's no card draw in here. So this kills it. So we terror him. And that's 16 damage. That's not enough for Torch yet. I'll retain those two. Even though the grand finale will be quite a while until, until we can get there again. Dagger spray is the last one. That's fun. Gain an artifact. Let's see. So that was actually pretty nice. It was a lot of damage. We finally got through all of the little guys. We negated the weak. Okay. Let's see. If we go for prepared, and then grand finale next turn. What do we get rid of? This one. And the Malays. We can neutralize him, we can shiv him. We could malaise him. No, we'll go for damage. He's dead now. Since we'll draw five cards and then Grand Finale deals 75 since he's vulnerable. That is beautiful. With retain and so many loot effects, the grand finale is actually worth it. Ooh, that's really good with retain as well. Your next skill is played twice. Got quite a few skills where burst would be nice, but I think we'll take bullet time. You can no longer use potions, but an additional energy. Yeah. I'm a fan of Sozu. We could go there or there as the shop. Mm. This is quite the ride. Oh, I like that the way I, the way I just indicated. That's a lot of prepared. Let's prepare some, I guess.
That's too much, sadly. We'll take five, uh, four damage and one hit onto the plated armor. That's the attack from left to right. And Grand Finale is gone. Taking six damage off the dagger spray, no. This floor is actually killing me. We have so little block in our deck that these things hurt. So we can kill you. Is there a way for me to, to get further? I think we gotta just take one damage. One damage is actually fine. Next week plus, that's a lot of block. Backflip could be nice. Let's take the next week plus. It's also weak, and the 4 energy is quite nice with that. Oh! I mean, yes. That's a good turn. Thank you, bullet time. Let's see. I don't think we need the survivor, and Shiv is the worst of those. I know we kill him. I'm pretty sure that's what happens. Well, I like the idea of escape plan. Upgrade a card. Terra costing nothing is great. Some more block to be had. I think Terra costing nothing is a huge upgrade. And a shop. Three attacks, gain four block. That's pretty nice. We could also dash and remove a card. I think that's actually right. We can deflect as well. Okay, what do we remove? What what is really bad? I basically never want to play deadly poison. So let's remove that. I think I'll keep the red. No, tools of the trade. Ah, oh, well laid plants. Another one that would have been nice. Okay. What does actually upgraded tools of the trade do? Costs nothing. That's a good upgrade. So we'll prepare. Say Joe. I think doing the, the melees for one is fine since we got the second one still and it dealt 5 damage off the choke. What am I looking for? I mean, Eviscerate is a pretty good hit. Let's see, we draw 6, 
Did we draw six? No, we don't have it yet. We draw five. Then with this next turn we draw six. I don't have enough prepare to go through there, but with this and next turn drawn six we got we got there. That's what I'm trying to say. Him now, go for a dash. We might need the dash next turn. Oh, it's 14 damage. So if I'm in lays now, I'll keep the bullet time in the grand finale, probably. Let's do it. I'll keep the grand finale for sure. We are weakened for another turn, sadly, but. Now our deck is empty. We'll discard prepared and we'll bullet time and then we go to town. That was pretty well thought out. I love when we could you can get finale to proc. What do we not need? leg sweep right now. We'll retain the finale. And then skewer him. Another block. I think we're skipping that. It's the nemesis. Of course it is. Actually, a good start though. So this is 6, 12, plus 5, 17, and this is 10, plus a shiv, so 14. This one's actually better. Could melee them now, but why bother? 50 damage with choked in on the first turn? That's a-okay. I think we're gonna malaise him. Or we can prepare it first. Give him the big malaise and then we can retain the dash, dash for next turn where we need to block. That's why I, I, I kept the vulnerable one, because I thought that was the one we could probably use. Actually we got prepared, dagger throw, grand finale. No, we got all of this for next turn. We got tools of the trade though. We're gonna draw one card too many. gonna be heartbreaking. We don't have the energy to play it this turn. Also we don't want to play it this turn since he's intangible. No. It's really heartbreaking actually. Get rid of this. We can melee them next turn. Leg sweep for the turn after, so we should get rid of this.
retain those two, Malays next turn, and then leg sweep the turn after. That's the best we could do. This is actually nice. Forty five block. Pretty good. Maybe we shouldn't have played all of them, by the way, because we got the retain. Should retain some damage for this turn, but I think we've got him still. Yeah, he's choking to death now. Additional 15 HP when resting, okay. Dagger Spray plus a second one, or a Envenom? No, oh, let's, let's go for a second Dagger Spray plus. I think we'll go left side. Smith. Get the backflip, I guess. It's a fight. We get two more relics of the next one. What's the best way to do this? Oh, I should have tarot first on this guy. I'm not too happy about this. We probably we could have killed him, but I thought, well, we can block in order to get some damage in, even though the thorns. Not happy about this, but we're taking five damage, and we got the riffraff out of the way. Okay, and we take some more damage, but this rear guardian is pretty low. Good 45. Okay. We got through his armor. Now he's armoring up, but... 30 damage? Hmm. I think we can actually do that. Yes, we can. Skip this. Again, the next two curses and unceasing top. Okay. Do you have another shop in common? Yeah, there is a shop in common. I don't think I want to buy the mask relic then. Uh, the the red mask puts one vulnerable on all enemies. That's not bad. 
surely isn't. But it's also not the greatest thing I've ever seen. And I think in the shop there's a chance for us to be better off in the end. spray is really nice and then it's 12 oh I shouldn't have done that probably Twenty-seven, thirty-two. that's 18 and 12 it's 30 right yeah we got there thanks to plated armor the thread and needle Doing work. That's a bullet time. That is a bullet time, though. Okay. What do I do now? Sadly. Should have retained the second piercing whale. Grand finale, we'll draw six cards and we only got ah uh, tools of the trade is annoying almost got there if we had a dagger throw left but instead we didn't get there I mean we got there so that's really good finally some good news Draw two cards when this is discarded. Yes, please. We got so many prepared. We can't use potions. That's it. Go for a last question mark. It is the more. Go and prepare some. I actually outplayed. I think that's the most damage. The dagger. Th Fan of daggers, fan of knives, no, what, what is it called? Dagger spray, deal 12 damage per energy. Oh, I don't have retain yet! Oh! Annoying. But, fair. Don't need... okay. Do I want to bullet time? Probably not, right? Unseizing top? Yes, unseizing top. Yes, unseizing top. Yes. Draw a few cards. Neutralize him again. I think that's fine, we'll retain this one. We got the 
reflects it there, they prepared. It was some beautiful stuff. Ah, close to the grand finale. Let's see what we got here. Give me a choke. No, my dude, that's no choke. I think that's all, all we got. So now we start with the dispensing of utter destruction. Retain the grand finale! I was focused on how do I get the most damage out of this. Eh, why not? We gotta rest now. So that I didn't pay attention. It's the. Why? Time Eater! Stop! This is the worst! Play infinite blades. Black sweep only if we retain. Neutralize is nice. No, let's get rid of the red black sweep. So I got four energy. One, two, three, four. We need the grand finale though, I think. Okay, flip works, goodbye. Oh wait, I can't grunt for now, I can't retain, since we don't have the retain power yet. That's a huge attack. What the... Balls. Oh, this is gonna be horrifying. Eleven. No, clock. So close. Getting hit for twelve and draw reduction. Okay. We got one spell this turn. It's probably gonna be tool of the trade. I didn't pay attention, should have used Piercing Whale. Because now we're gonna get hit for 8 and our plated armor is reduced yet again. Piercing Whale could have prevented that. You know what? Screw you. I retain the reflex for sure. And plating plated armor is down yet again. So this is gonna be a big one. Choke. Dagger spray. Prepared. That's a ridiculously good prepared. A nice eviscerate. A second prepared. Never infinite blades. A 
now that repaired. Retaining bullet time seems like a good idea. So this is the most damage. 8, 9, 10. Didn't get there, but I think this is good enough. We really choked him out there. For 9 spells, right? Don't need you? No, don't need you for sure. The grand finale bullet time. Do we want grand finale bullet time actually? We got leg sweep. Yeah, let's confirm that. I think we can actually get grand finale to work. Nice. We do get grand finale to work. Because now I go prepared. Don't need the prepared. And I don't need. Using well is nice. Probably not the survivor, right? How much how much no, we need the survivor. And the piercing whale. Okay. Now we bullet time. Oh he cleanses the debuff, sadly. Blocked everything. Unseizing top doesn't work since we got bullet time. That was still a great, a great turn. Choose a card to discard. This one, yes. You'll get choked, and we'll prepare. Never infinite blades. Nine. 10, 11, 12, guess we'll retain both of them. That was a really good turn with Choke, I think we get another kill on the Time Eater. Okay, maybe I spoke too soon. So, there's a dagger throw in here. Nice, we did. Oh. Surely I want this. So, nine. We draw six, so they'll be on three. Prepared and dagger throw is exactly three cards. We need to draw them, though. No dagger throw. Nice. And I think we can actually kill him with a grand finale now. Since we got backflip, we'll draw six cards. If the last card is dagger throw, we, we're, we're screwed. Let's just hope that's not the case. There's dagger throw. I think we can get rid of this. No, wait. I think we... Dagger throw. I don't care. Grand Finale as the last ca card played. That's a flavor I wouldn't have ever seen one. And the Silent comes back. 600 damage. It's a strange deck. We got Champion, Librarian, Collector. It's just prepared. How many did we get? Five? Five prepared. <laughs> At least we got a bit. Unend Strike and Reflex are both. Incredible. So we got a bit of discard synergy. Could have been a lot better. But I think it was fine. Choke again with all the prepared. Extremely nice. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you had as much fun as I had. And I'll see you in the next.